Hey guys, welcome to Easy Photo Booth. This is a basic tutorials on how to load your template that uh, is on your system uh, using Paint. So basically, what we have here is your template. You can go to your standard. Uh, it's located into your desktop. Um, go ahead and open the background that's there for you to modify it, open it using paint. Uh, you can zoom out first, you know, to see the actual layout. Okay, that changes the color of the entire uh, template. Now what we're doing here is we're deleting uh, the graphics that's on it now. We're basically starting from scratch. Okay, we're gonna change. We're gonna uh, we're gonna go back to the DSLR. We're gonna go to the settings. We're checking right now the layout, you know, of the pictures. So, so we know how uh, you know how it's laid out. We're gonna create a text black text and we'll just put um, happy birthday just as a sample now we're gonna shrink that just a bit to size it up now we're gonna copy that text okay after we shrink it We're just gonna put it on the edge so that it's nicely done. Let's work. And paste. So basically, we just replicated the happy birthday twice because we're creating a, a photo strip. So. center and copy it and then push it back using the space bar and just move you can move it and bring it down a little bit towards you know you don't want to create an overlapping pictures because remember there's three photos in there and those three photos uh, will basically cover the text if you make it too big. So make sure that it's just uh, just right. Now we're gonna go ahead and uh, okay. We're gonna go ahead and, and check it to see if um, it's there. But what we did was we saved whatever it was uh, that was there. But obviously, like I said earlier, it's got you know if the text is too big, it's gonna cover it. So right now, we're gonna zoom out and then we're gonna redo it and we're gonna resize those texts so that it's not being covered by. Um, actually, we can just move it, move it a little bit on the edge, so that it's not being covered. And after we do this, we're just gonna go and resave it again. So now we just saved it. Go back there to check. So if that is the locations that you, you know, you're setting it up to, then yeah, that layout should be good. We're gonna zoom out again. On the bottom, right here. We'll write another text. Uh, the date 2014 obviously you can change the background color of this template any way you want it doesn't have to be plain white you could choose from any of those color palettes uh, any way you want it so. 
I mean, this is the most simplest way to create a template using Breeze software and using Paint. So that's pretty much it. You save it and, uh, you know, you load it up in there again. I change, you hit save and, and change the settings on that blue curtain. And uh, what you're basically doing is you're replacing the memory so that it remembers your template. Then you can go to full screen photo booth mode and uh, that's pretty much it. Thanks guys. Hope that was uh, helpful for you.